Good morning guys, it is vlogmas day number seven and I just got up, well I didn't just get up, I've been in the shower, but I got up 30 minutes later today because I edited yesterday's vlog last night and that was so good, it was so nice of having a little bit of an extra lion. Um, I probably will go back to editing them in the morning though because it's, it lets me like chill in the evenings rather than having to edit a video every night. So this morning I'm just getting ready slowly because I'm not in a rush. I actually have like a whole bunch of new kids coming in to meet me and some of the other teachers that are in my team today so that's going to be really exciting and then I've got a school event after work so it won't, probably won't be home until late today so today's vlog might be a little bit short so please excuse that if it is a little bit short but yeah I have been really enjoying vlogmas this year not that I didn't enjoy it last year but man it's been so much fun like it's really funny going places and like shoving cameras in people's faces I love it and in saying that, I know that they don't mind being in Vlogmas. I don't just shove it into my, like, random people's faces. So I thought today, while I was getting ready, I'd answer your guys' questions. I, um, my, my mirror is just here if you're wondering why I'm looking over here. I actually, um, got two questions yesterday that I didn't answer, so I did want to come on here and answer them because they were really good questions. So thank you guys so much for, for um, asking me them. To everybody else, or if you want to ask another one, if you guys are watching and you want to ask me a question, or if you want me to talk about a particular topic, Feel free to post it down below because I really, really enjoy communicating with you guys and I think this is a really good way to do it. I'm going to answer this question first and it's from Brooke Day and she said, Never really heard much about a bullet journal but it looks awesome and I love the idea of it. Do you think that you could explain it? Tell us what it is and all about it. I actually have a video on what is a bullet journal so if you want to check that out I'll leave it linked off down below for you Brooke but... Um, I can do more stuff about them in the daily vlogs, but that's just like, I don't know if it's really a crash course, but it's pretty explanatory about what it is. So I definitely recommend that you go and check that out. The next question is from Shannon V and it says, do you have any goals or major plans for your channel in 2018? Or if you don't want to answer that, will you do any traveling? So my goals for YouTube in the next year are hopefully to grow. I mean, I would love to hit 50,000 subscribers, but I don't know if you guys know this, but my channel has very, very, very little growth to no growth like I don't think my channel's grown in like a year and a half to two years if anything I've lost subscribers which is really disheartening because I don't think my content is that bad <laughs> I for a while have been contemplating whether you know YouTube is the market for me because I feel like no matter how much I try I'm just not you know it's not kicking off like you guys know that I do this more as a hobby this is my part-time thing but it would be great to you know because the amount of hours that I've put into this over the years, I've been doing YouTube for like seven years, so it would be nice to sort of, you know, get something back from it. But it's not why I'm here, obviously. As you can imagine, it would be nice to have that sort of monetary support as well. But I think I'm going to give YouTube another year and see how it goes. Like, I really enjoy the video making process, but it's like, if my videos aren't growing, like, what's the point? It's all. It's also about personal growth, like... I kind of, I'm not done with YouTube at the moment obviously, but I don't know if I'm better off somewhere else like doing blogging or like exclusively doing Twitch or you know, I'm just kind of going to experiment for the next year. Probably not going to experiment with blogging because I don't have a blog. Blogs, um, I ha well I had a blog but I need to work on like a you know website and stuff and I don't know if I can fund that right now but we'll see. I'm not really too sure. Um, what is on the horizon for me. I really like this question, but um, I don't know. I'm definitely going to be doing YouTube for at least at least another year, and then I'm going to kind of reevaluate my life. And in terms of my travel plans for the next year, um, I definitely think we're going to do a lot of regional travel because my friend Emily is moving back to Dunedin. So we're going to be going to Dunedin quite a bit. I want to go see Sally in New Plymouth. I also want to pop down and see Shannon in Palmerston North. So I want to do a lot of regional travel. I also want to do um, a trip to like Southeast Asia, so either like, it is Southeast Asia right, like Bali or Thailand. We've already been to Thailand, um, but I'd love to go to one of those places. I don't know if we will, but it's okay to aspire, right? And we are going to Melbourne at the end of this year, so I don't know if you can't really call that next year's travel plans, but you know. I'm going to be there next year for a little bit, so yeah, I'm pretty excited about that too. By the way guys, I may or may not have forgotten to take off my makeup last night and when I woke up in the morning my eyebrows were completely, completely untouched. 
they looked perfect and I sleep like face down slash on the side of my face so it's not like I'm on my back like this you know I sleep really messy and they were perfect so just thought I'd let you guys know that I'm not proud of my bad life choices you know by sleeping with my makeup on I never do that but last night I was absolutely exhausted Oh my god, it's so annoying. Oh my god, there's nothing worse than hearing the rubbish man when you forgot your rubbish. I just came on to tell you guys that I was running early and then I saw that Sally Joe uploaded a Vlogmas last night and I watched that and now I'm not that early. Poop. Anyway, see you guys. I nearly forgot my lunch. As in like I was outside the door and then I remembered. I made a frittata which I tried to film to put in the vlog but um it just didn't turn out, so I can show it to you guys another time if you want to see it. It's just a super simple recipe. But yeah, okay, bye. Hey guys, so I just got home from work and I've just changed into this sort of semi, more formal outfit. It's actually really not that formal, but who really cares? Because I've got a school event tonight, so I've gotten changed for that. I'm gonna have one of these. This is not sponsored. I bought these myself. They're by Nothing Naughty, and they're like little protein bars, and they're so good. This one tastes like pineapple lumps. Like, you guys know I'm a picky eater, so I wouldn't lie. You know how when people like, why is this down halfway? There we go. You know how people are like, oh my god, like this product, healthy product tastes exactly like this non-healthy product. You know how people say that, and then it doesn't. Um, this actually tastes pretty much exactly the same as pineapple lumps. Just has less chocolate, obviously, because there's only chocolate around the outside of the bar. Whoa, okay. But yeah, I'm just really quickly home just to touch up my makeup. You can see I'm like a sweaty beast. There's nothing that I can do to stop it in the summertime, honestly. It's just too hot. Um, by the way, my top is from Moreau, if you guys were wondering. I think it's really cute. I've worn this a few times. It's even so hot that my mascara sweated off. And Benefit Roller Lash doesn't sweat off. That's how hot it was today. Do you guys know of a good brand of blotting papers? I don't normally need them, but I feel like I need them in the summertime. So yeah, I've literally been home for five minutes and I'm gonna go straight back to work. I just needed to make sure that my face looks fractionally better. I might just put on some lip gloss. This is the next Butter Gloss in Vanilla Cream Pie, just so that I don't look completely disheveled. I feel like a lip color always makes you look better. And that's the thing that I wear the least during the week because there's lots of upkeep, but I only need to look good for this event. So I'm at home now and it's been ages since I last filmed anything. I went to my school event, then I got home and then I started to have a nap and then Corbett filmed as a super zoom of my face and then I went and had a shower and then here we are. So yeah, I'm pretty much doing nothing tonight. We're getting fish and chips for dinner. I just ordered some fish and chips, so I'm pretty excited. Are you guys excited? So excited, so much yes. excitement. Yeah! <laughs> yeah, we're pretty excited for fish and chips, and I think we're gonna watch, well, we're gonna watch Riverdale. I've decided we're gonna watch Riverdale. I'm so excited! So excited! I'm, I'm yes. so excited to show you guys, and I'm excited about being so excited. Corby thinks I say excited too much, and I do, but I am always excited! This is my fish and chips haul. Oh, Unboxing. This is very hard. It's like, oh, I ripped it. Yes! Beautiful. If you guys, aren't, if you guys aren't from New Zealand, you're probably like, what is this? Or England, England, England. Yeah, England too. But yeah, I'm going to eat all of this. And I have a Bundaberg over there somewhere. But yeah. Your baby. Yeah. So I'm in bed again and I'm going to finish the vlog now because I am exhausted. I know today has been a really short vlogmas video and I'm really sorry about that. I've just had a super busy week with work and stuff this week. So it's kind of just catching up to me now. So yeah, I'm just going to play a little bit of World of Warcraft for a little while because it is still quite early. It's only like 9. Um, but I just kind of want to wind down and get comfy and get ready to go to bed. So yeah, let me know what you guys want to see in the next vlogmas video like what kind of questions you want to answer what topics you want me to talk about thank you to the people who have already asked me questions and stuff like that hope that you guys have had a really great day night evening whatever wherever you are i love you guys so much and i'll see you all in tomorrow's vlogmas video bye